Hey everyone. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and film this video because it is for my dear friend, Clarissa, uh, AKA Karamia's corner. Um, this is what I'm sending her for her birthday, but I'm not going to put this up until her birthday. So she won't know what it is um, until she gets the package and, and um, unboxes it. Now I will say that her birthday presents are twofold because she's already received the first part of her birthday gift, which I ordered from Amazon. And it is a teapot. Um, actually, let me pull it up here. We were talking and she had, you know, gotten back from Japan and we were talking about Japanese tea and stuff and how um, neither of us have like the gooseneck spout um, type of kettle. And so, you know, she was like saying that she really wanted one. So I was like, you know what? I gotcha. So that discussion was probably last month, not last month in February, but in January. So I actually got her this <laughs> and it's like a mint with brown um, trimmings. And yeah, I'm pretty sure she's going to love it. I wish I could order it for myself, but we already have a hot water kettle. So. So she's got that, which I will have her unbox um, in a Google Meet with our friend. And so I decided, yeah, like I had said in a previous video, I usually order her like a vintage ephemera box from Art Atelier. But since they're not being done anymore, I decided, okay, I will just make her some stuff. So the first thing is I've wrapped up this right here, this book, but I'll, I'll talk about it later. I went to a... Um, antique store and was able to find some vintage postcards. This one right here, which is really, really nice. I haven't even like taken it out of the packaging here. Look at this. It's from 1916 right there. If I can get close so you can see the postmark. 1916. I mean, I just like the way it looked, you know? And so I am giving her a notebook that is um, kind of, you know, vintage looking as well um, that I had found. And each page is different. So she can use that to do whatever. She can write poems. She can write skits. She can collage. She can do whatever. And I decorated the outside of the, um, of the packaging to make it a little bit more special, you know? So... She gave me this <laughs> for my birthday last year. So the next thing I did get was from a different um, antique store here in my hometown. And I thought when I saw this, the colors are what attracted me. I got her this vintage handkerchief. Look at that. It's beautiful. The colors. I just love it. So I thought she would like that. I need to put it in a... Um, I need to wrap it up in some tissue, actually. Then I also got her this in um, New Orleans when I was there last month for Mardi Gras. Now, the box is from some jewelry that I purchased, but she likes hummingbirds, so I put it in this box. So I got this for her, and I thought red would be nice because it'll catch the light really pretty. Um, it's a beaded hummingbird that she can hang in the window, you know. And just, yeah. So put that in there. Hopefully it doesn't get messed up in transit. And I thought this would look really well. With that, I made her two tags. So this is why I got back into doing my collage and, you know, junk journaling type of stuff. Um, so this first one right here, I did this one for her. Okay, and then this one. This one actually was the very first one that I did. So she's going to get that, those two as well. Um, and then the last thing I've put in here. So like I said in the past, I go to the bin stores, the Amazon return stores, and I was able to find this for a dollar. <laughs> so it was in a plastic bag like this, and I found three. Actually, I went back the next day and found two more 50 cents each. So I think I might have shown this in a previous video. I'm not sure. So let's go through this first. 
So these are various papers, actually. <coughs> I'll turn it there. Each of them comes with doilies, okay? <coughs> and they're printed on like vellum. They're just different um, themes, okay? And they're really good for her junk journals that she makes to sell and does herself. And then also these, these are, it's by Mocard, but I'm not sure, I haven't used mine yet. I think they're stickers, or maybe not, I'm not sure. But yeah, they were just wrapped around this. So like I said, I had found a total of three. So I'm giving her one because it goes well with the stuff that she um, tends to make and she can use this. So yeah, so that's just a quick um, showing of what I am sending my dear friend. And um, Clarissa, when you're watching this, happy birthday. I wish I could be there again for your birthday, but you know, maybe next year, who knows? Or maybe you can come and visit me during my birthday next year because um, you haven't been in Memphis yet. All right. Okay, guys. So have a good week. Have a good weekend. Bye.